everyone. Hey, welcome back to Pokemon Scarlet and Violet. Last time we, um... We did quite a bit. I mean, we didn't really do a lot, but we actually did something. We fought our first Titan. And now I have already made the choice for our next um, destination. This will be the gym and this. The Dark Cruise Base. Set out our destination. Anyways, there isn't anything to say, so feel free to like, subscribe, and share this with your friends. And without further ado, we can start by... For now, we're gonna capture a Pokemon. Whittle. I think for now, it is just better to warm. Move on with where we can. Cause I tried to go for the psychic fight. But... I um I could. All right. Now to cap. Time to send to the box. Alright. Now we're gonna head off to our destination. We got some candy. Alright. So... Oh, I can even see the city just over there. Of gym leader. Oh, there's um, a character head. I thought those things would be kind of rare. Given the one I encountered. Alright. Oh, there's a raid down over there. And it's a golden one. That's, um... Interesting. Kinda looks like Wobbuffet. In there. What is that poke? Oh, it's the Anaconda. Oh, it's the Lacoba. Alright. Okay. Well, I know it'll work again. Alright. 
that was an easy one. Time to send to the box. Alrighty. Okay, that's some... Those are just some fan people and stuff. There's a rock rock, of course. Alright. Now to get out of this. Oh, I can just... I can see it up ahead. I can see my loop. What are you? got captured. I don't even have enough to warm. Okay. Well then, why don't we just heal? Check the map. Oh, we're, um... Actually closing in on that territory, it seems. Either we could go straight to the gym, or we could just deal with them. But I'm pretty sure the best solution would be to deal with Cassiopeia here. I see you're getting close with it. Yeah, I see. Alright. So this operation... Yeah, you definitely don't look like someone I've met before. The name's Clyde. Um... You look like the, um... You look like the headmaster of the academy. And how long have you been spying on us? No need to get your hack open. I'm a power army boy. 
right here. Isn't that... I guess, maybe? We're talking about going up against Team Star here, so it's not something you can win in fun. I am aware. I just need some sort of unsettled business as Team Star, that's all. Besides, I tend to get the job done well. Not that you can take my word for it, but it's true. Star and I share some history. That's all I can say for now. Why do I feel like yours are a leader? Like they're a real leader. Now back to business. Let's talk Operation Star. What would you have us do? Simply put, I want you to raid each one of their star bases. Then you'll defeat the bosses of the team and put an end to their war. Alright. And that's the base. On the other side of those is the base proper, and somewhere within that base lies one of the targets, a squad boss. If someone challenges a squad bosses to a battle, they have no choice but to accept. And what's more, if they happen to lose the battle, they must forfeit their role as a boss altogether. I went ahead and issued these challenges to each base under the name names. They are basically declarations of war. Now all of Team Star knows that we're looking for a fight. Let's say we defeat the bosses from their roles, what happens next? The rest of the team crumbled with no one left to leave them, that's what happens. That's a solid plan, but not without wrinkles. Each base has a bunch of Pokemon inside to feed off intruders, and the bases themselves up and they are a considerable size. Your garden variety trainer would be overrun long before they get anywhere near the boss. That's why your skills are essential to this operation. Defeat the Pokemon inside the base and drag the boss from wherever they're hiding. I know how that works. And what will you be doing in the meantime? Like I said, I have history with Team Star. That means I can't operate from the open. Okay. Sorry, I don't trust you completely just yet. For now, I'd like you to monitor the, monitor the bases and act as a place of support. You're a cautious one, alright? I respect that. I'll retouch again when the plan advances to the next phase. Good luck hunting out there. We'll go get him. I'm just at right. I have no right. I have no idea what you mean. But if anyone asks you about me, remember this. I'm Clive. A normal academy student just like you, nothing more, nothing less. Alright. You look kinda old to be um going to what looks like to be an elementary or, an, or a high school. Whatever this is in the Pokemon world. Now then. Whoa, whoa, hold it, you. Up ahead is the base of operations for Team Dark's crew. You may know us as the Seagun Squad. And we don't get too kindly to random kids sniffing around our turf. But if you don't turn yourself around... Wait, hold up. Are you that Blitz kid? You know that piece of work we're out to get for declaring... Raw and Team Star? Alright. You know what? Doesn't matter who you want, you're, you're not getting screwed. Alright.
challenged by the Team Star Glide. Merklow. Alright. Oh. Okay. That is not gonna work out. Everyone in my party is just going down. Alright. Kinda wish that would apply on Paralyze. I don't have anyone that can, uh... I don't have any revive. Alright. Yeah, that was on. Well, we're gonna lose. That's a one-hit kill. We are gonna lose. And that's fine. It's not like it will matter anyway. Center. Thank you. Okay, I do not have any money. Could sell the TMs. Well, let me sell Sunny Day. I'm not selling Electro Ball. I might be able to use that if, if I find a Pokemon for it. I could sell this luxury ball. Oh. 
Um, I didn't, I forgot I could even do that. Now, um, let's try this again. Without, um, being stupid. We're gonna go and try that again. Let's try this again. Even though there's a chance we may get the first move. Do one get anyway. I think Leo is gonna do some wonders on it. Alright. Because then... Oh. If... Yeah. Yes. He gets the attack. Revive more Ghana. Morgana wants to learn Seed Bomb. Alright. I'm replacing Scratch. Alright. Now I'm taking you on next. Okay, she's in the team, you know. Might have a little chat about with her about that attitude. Well, I'm gonna go into the base now and give the rest of the squad a heads up. We'll come at you full force if you set foot inside, so you might want to consider turning tails. Best of luck to you either way, amigo. Oh boy. I see you took care of the guards, well, one of them. Now hold up in that base is teams, Team Star's Dark Crew, the Seagan Squad. Their boss, 
Giacomo is pretty much runs the whole Team Star. He also produced that wild soundtrack of theirs himself. Almost breaking the fourth wall there, I see. He's a sharp guy, even our declaration of war won't be have him ruffled in the slightest. His plan is probably to wear you down with a wave of runs. Then you finish him off himself. Alright. Let's see. Alright. Revive the Fletchling. Wait, oh, the first three Pokemon in my party? <laughs> 